We're back with more Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. This is part five. In today's episode, we're going to be getting some new songs. First and foremost, we're heading for Lawn Lawn Ranch. As you may recall, Malin said she was from here, so I thought it would be nice to pay her a visit. And of course, oh boy, we got a big one to worry about. I beg your pardon, sir. Oh, bastard actually hit me a couple times. Oh, good. Sun's coming out. It's only a matter of time before we're safe. But at the same time, I've got to wait for that rooster to crow before I can actually go in. Come on. There we go. Open for business. Welcome to Lawn Lawn Ranch. A pleasant slice of life. First thing we're going to do here is we're going to go to the house. After all, it is morning, so I'm sure Talon and Melon are just getting up and ready for breakfast. Or he fell asleep at the switch. Huh? I'm awake already. What? Well, I'll be. If it ain't the forest kid from the other day. By the way, thanks for waking me up. It took some doing, but I finally got Malin back in a good mood. So, what are you up to today? Got some free time on your hands, you say? Well, how about a little game? These three cuckoos I have here are special super cuckoos. I'm gonna throw these cuckoos into that there gaggle of normal cuckoos. If you can pick out these three special birds from the um, among the normal cuckoos within the time limit, I'll give you something good. Pay attention to that something good because he is not joking. If you can't find them, I win. It'll be ten rupees. Wanna play? Sure. You have thirty seconds. All right then. Get ready. Here go the super cuckoos. Start looking. Okay, one goes right by the door, so... Nice! Picked him out first. That's one of them. Keep it up. Keep it up. Two more to find. Alright. That's going pretty good. Fine. Stop moving around. Nice! That's two. There's another. Alright now. The moment of truth. One more to find. And I've got 20 seconds to work with, so that's great. Holy smokes, I got them all. One, two, three, bang, 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 all ducks in a row. Golly, I'm a darn. It's Plum Incredible. That's the last one. You found them all. Come on over here. Nice. <laughs> hey, you. You've got the town to be one of the world's best cowboys. How would you like to marry a mountain, huh? That's your prize? Gee, you're... Kinda of putting me on the spot, but yes. <laughs> I was just kidding, just kidding. I think you're a little young for that, aren't you? <laughs> oh, I'm proud to present you a sample of our very own lawn lawn milk. You'll be energized from the moment you drink it. After you drink it, you can bring back the bottle and buy a refill anytime you want. At this point in the game, lawn lawn milk is very handy to have. Yeah, it's a sea item, and here's how it works. Every time you drink it, you recover five hearts, and you can use it twice for the potential to recover ten hearts at a time. All right. Thanks, dude. I'll be seeing you. You know, truth be told, I don't actually have to buy refills because I know of a trick you can use to get free Lawn Lawn Milk wherever and whenever you want. And there's another spider. If I've been keeping count correctly, this one will be number six. There we go. Now, aside from Lawn Lawn Milk, this place is actually famous for breeding horses. They've got a nifty little racetrack shaped in an oval, and some awesome looking horses. I mean, look at this fella. Shut up, Navi, I'm admiring the horse. Hey, where are you going? Okay, well. Have fun, then. Now there's the real reason we came here. Hubba hubba, hello, baby, I missed you. Oh, it's the fairy boy again. I heard that you found my dad. How did you like the castle? Did you see the princess? Hee <laughs> hee. You wouldn't believe me if I told you, but yeah, I saw her. She's nice. <laughs> dad came home in a hurry after you found him. Hee. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
I have to introduce you to my friend, Fairy Boy. She's this horse. Her name is Epona. Isn't she cute? Actually, yes, she is. What the? Shut up, Navi! Uh, tell me, miss. What's with that horse? It seems like Epona is afraid of you, Fairy Boy. Oh, there's nothing wrong with that. Shut up, Navi! My mother composed this song. Isn't it nice? Let's sing together. Yeah, sure thing. Navi, for the last time, shut your goddamn pie hole. I don't need you going, hey, listen, all the time. I swear, I'm going to need to put up a counter for that sort of shit. But anyway, let's whip out the ocarina, because once we do, we learn a new song. Oh, never mind. Okay, okay. Ah, there we go. Now I've got it triggered. And yes, I am going to play the song on this ocarina. I mean, that's why I have it. Once again, six notes, and it's a repeating pattern. If I hadn't said it before, I'll say it now. And if I have, I apologize, and this will be something of a reminder. With each passing song we learn, it's going to come in handy in a special spot along the way to get the third spiritual stone. I'll better explain it once I get there. But for now, we learned our second song, Epona's Song. And this is actually a pretty interesting shot in the game. Cut, cut, cut! What is that owl doing? Ugh, great, now we gotta do the whole thing over again. Uh, Malin, what, what is your horse doing to me? Epona, yeah, whoa, horsey, whoa! Malin, help! Your horse is trying to jump my bones! Forget it, I'm out of here. Now, before we leave the ranch, there's one more thing I want to get. I'm not sure if you saw it from before, but there's actually a tall tower in the back, just on the other side of the track. Inside is a very valuable item which we're going to need to make use of. And at the same time, once we get it, we get a free health boost. And once again, shut up, Navi! Yeah, it's right over here. Oh, we got cows as well. Now, let's see. Oh, yeah! That's exactly what I meant when I said you can get free milk. Because now that we've learned Epona Song, if we come across cows anywhere in the land, if we play Epona Song, the cows will start talking and say that because they hear the song, they feel really good, and they can produce a lot of milk. If you have an empty bottle, you can use it to store milk. So basically, if you need a little bit of a healing touch-up, that song and a cow is a godsend. And looky what we have here. Oh boy. There go my dogs again. But yeah, this is our first piece of heart. More heart containers mean more life energy. And we got a free health boost. Alright. So far, that's about all we can do on the ranch. So, with that done, let's get out of here. Or as the cowboys would say, let's mosey on off into the sunset. Okay. Let's keep on going. But fear not. We will not be saying goodbye to this place for per for good. We will be coming back in the future. Oh yes. Because there are still a lot of things we need to get. We don't have the means to acquire them all, but believe me, we will in due time. So if I had to say, nice place. And shut up, Navi! Uh, Navi, sometimes you make me so mad, you just make me want to do this, and this, and some of this! Uh, Damn fairy. But you know what? We're not quite finished yet. The next thing we're going to do, believe it or not, is we're actually going back to the forest. Why? Well, because I miss my friend Saria. I'm sure she's worried sick about me. And who knows? She might give us something good. Actually, knowing the kind of bond that we have, she will give me something good. And get your minds out of the gutter, guys. She's just going to give me a song. 
Abby, for the last fucking time, shut your goddamn pie hole! Oh, good. There's the path under the forest. This rule is a godsend. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's definitely an improvement, and it makes things go by a lot quicker. Although, hearing go, Link go, ha! Yeah! Yeah! Gets annoying after a while. Ah, home sweet home. Now, where we're going to go is actually the back of the forest, that are known as the Lost Woods. In this section, you're going to need to use your ears to find out where you're going. Alright, so just up around the corner. Not only are we going to find Soria in here, but we're actually going to find ourselves some useful items. Now the trick is, if you hear the song on one of the four pathways, take it. Alright. Now the item we're going to get, right here. Quite simple. Line of shot. Okay. There we go. Hit three perfect bullseyes. And the scrub will come out. Cool! You're great! You scored three perfect bullseyes! I have to give you a neat present to such a wonderful person. Please take it. Nice. We get ourselves a bullet bag, which will stash up to 40 bullets, so basically, an ammo expansion. There we go. Ugh, that damn elegant. Hey, over here! Hoo-hoo! Good to see me again? Well, I didn't really want to see you. I want to skip this. No, I don't want to hear it again. I know what you're going to say. I'll follow the music. I'll find Saria. Now fuck off, you dumb feathered freak. You still here? Good. You're gone. Shut up, Navi! Okay. There we go. I think I want to turn left here. Yep. And... Up top. Alright. Sacred Forest Meadow. Come on, Wolfie. What do you got? Gotcha. Try it again. I dare you. Stop moving around. There we go. Even though I did not check that thing's name, it was a Wolfos. At this point, it was the most tricky enemy we fought. Although not terribly difficult. Ugh. Damn scrub. Get over here, you little bitch! Pain in the ass. Seeing these things all over High World makes me want to sing some TLC. I know, I know. Bad joke, but... Fuck, these things are actually shit with me pretty bad. Ugh. Yeah, that's right, you hide like a little bitch. <sighs> but we're almost there. And if push comes to shove, I'll just drink some milk. Move it, Link. Nice. And here we are. Hmm. Nice look at place. Oh, and there she is. Quite the song she's playing, too. Hey, baby. I'm back. I've been waiting for you, Jeremy. This is the Sacred Forest Meadow. It's my secret place. I feel... This place will be very important for both of us someday. That's what I feel. If you played the ocarina here, you could talk with the spirits in the forest. 
Would you like to play the ocarina with me? Sure. Okay. Try to follow along with the melody I will play. Are you ready? Bring it on. This will be song number three we learn. And an easy one. Got it. It's a very happy tune. <laughs> great! Great! Please don't forget this song. Do you promise? I couldn't forget even if I wanted to. When you want to hear my voice, play Saria's song. You can talk with me anytime. Okay, that part always annoy me. She's speaking in first person and in third person. Make up your mind, bitch! But like I said, we have our third song. So it's all good. You've learned Saria's song. Excellent. Now to get out of here and fix my health problem. Okay, avoid him. And that thing. Ah, perfect, a ladder. Perfect for a shortcut. Down the hole. And this should... Bingo. Thank you very much. And I think we're good for now. Yeah, you know what? I think I'm just gonna stop right here. We've got two songs, we made our women, and all was right with the world. So, thanks for watching, and I'm sorry if this one seemed like a bit of a boring episode as well. Trust me, in the future, we will get back, back to fighting. In the next one, we're gonna make our way to Kakariko Village. But until then, this is Jeremy saying, as always, cheers and beers. See you next time.